Hey boys and girls, welcome back. So this week we've been talking all about things that live in the ocean. So today, boys and girls, I have a fun little story we're going to read. This is the book right here. This book is about a teeny tiny little fish named Swimmy. And Swimmy learns pretty quickly that the ocean can be a pretty scary place for a little fish. There's all sorts of other big fish out there. And guess what those big fish like to do to little fish? Yeah, they like to eat them. So this is the story about Swimmy. And he comes up with a really cool plan to about how he can go and explore the ocean and still feel safe from all those other big fish. So let's read Swimmy together. It's written by Leo Leone. He wrote the book. He's the author and he drew the pictures too. So let's read. Do you see Swimmy? Oh, yep, there he is. There's a little Swimmy. A happy school of little fish lived in a corner of the sea somewhere. They were all red. Only one of them was black as a mussel shell. He swam faster than his brothers and sisters. His name was Swimmy. Oh, there's Swimmy right there. And look at all of his brothers and sisters in his big school of fish. That's what they call a group of fish that swim together. They call it a school. <gasps> oh no. Look at that. That is a big fish. And look right there. I see sharp teeth. So what does that tell me? And that tell me he, that he's probably looking for some other fish to eat. One day... A bad tuna fish, swift, fierce, and very hungry, came darting through the waves. In one gulp, he swallowed all the little red fish. Only Squimmy escaped. Oh, oh, here's all the red fish, and there's Swimmy right down at the bottom, darting away to safety. Mm -hmm. He swam away in the deep wet world. He was scared, lonely, and very sad. Oh, there's Swimmy right there in the big dark ocean all alone. But the sea was full of wonderful creatures. And as he swam from marvel to marvel, Swimmy was happy again. He saw a Medusa made of rainbow jelly. Look how beautiful with all the colors. A lobster who walked about like a water moving machine. There's the lobster and there's Swimmy. You can see how small Swimmy is when he's right next to that lobster. I wonder what else he'll see in the ocean. Strange fish pulled by an invisible thread. Look, they're all going the same direction. Fish like to swim the same direction. When you see fish swimming together, they're usually all going together. And a forest of seed seaweeds growing like sugar candy rocks. Oh, look how beautiful. Underneath in the ocean, there's seaweed and it grows in different colors and it really is quite beautiful. Oh, what's that? Do you know what that is? It's like a snake that lives in the water in the ocean. It's called an eel. An eel whose tail was almost too far away to remember. Look, here's the front of the eel, and then zoom, 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 all the way back there is his tail. And who's that right there? Little Swimmy. In sea anemones, who looked like pink palm trees swaying in the wind, right there. Those are the sea anemones. Wow, they're beautiful. And there's little Swimmy. Then, hidden in the dark shade of rocks and weeds, he saw a school of fish 
just like his own. Look at them all over there. Let's go swim and play and see things, he said happily. We can't, said the little red fish. The big fish will eat us all. Oh no, the little red fish are scared. They're afraid that they're going to be eaten by a big fish. But you can't just lie there, said Swimmy. We must think of something. Hmm, I wonder what they'll do. Oh, there's Swimmy down there. And there's the red fish. Here are all the red fish right here. Swimmy thought and thought and thought. Then suddenly he said, I have it. We are going to swim all together like the biggest fish in the sea. Hmm. They're going to swim all together like the biggest fish in the sea? I wonder how that will work. Let's keep reading to find out. Oh, I see what they're doing. Look at all the red fish. It looks like they're all going to swim together in the same direction like we talked about. And it looks like they're getting in like a certain formation or a certain shape. What is that starting to look like? Yeah, it's starting to look like all the little red fish are swimming together and they're gonna be so close together that they look like a big, huge fish. He taught them to swim close together, each in its own place. <gasps> Whoa, look at that. It does look like a big, huge fish. And do you see Swimmy? There he is right there. And when they all learned to swim like one giant fish, he said, I'll be the eye. And there he is right there being the eye of the fish. That was good thinking. And so they swam in the cool morning water and in the midday sun. Look, here they are swimming together. And look, here are some big fish and it looks like all the little red fish are chasing the big fish away. And they chased the big fish away. And that's the end of our story called Swimmy. Wasn't that a great story, boys and girls? So boys and girls, next I have a fun song that I wanna do with you. It's called Slippery Fish. Now, boys and girls, I sent your special grown-ups. Um, I sent them something that look like this. They're pictures of some different characters that go in the song Slippery Fish. And if your special grown-up can, you could print those out, color them in, and maybe cut them out, and you could make some little character sticks kind of like the ones that I made here. And these will help us with our song, Slippery Fish. So what we're gonna do first, I would like you boys and girls to see if you can learn the song first. So we're gonna watch a Slippery Fish song and it's really fun. We're gonna watch all that and then after we finish watching Slippery Fish, we're gonna get back together and we're gonna sing Slippery Fish together. Okay, so we're gonna watch it first and then we'll get back together to sing Slippery Fish. All right, so let's watch the video. Slippery fish, slippery fish, sliding through the water. Slippery fish, slippery fish. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, it's been eaten by a octopus, octopus, squiggling in the water. Octopus, octopus. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no, it's been eaten by a tuna fish, tuna fish, flashing through the water. 
water. Tuna fish, tuna fish. Oh no, it's been eaten by a great white shark, great white shark, lurking in the water. Great white shark, great white shark. Humongous whale, humongous whale, spouting in the water. Humongous whale, humongous whale. Hey, boys and girls, wasn't that a funny little song called Slippery Fish? That is one of my favorite songs to sing. So now that you were able to watch a little video of it, I thought maybe we could sing it together. That would be a lot of fun, wouldn't it? So I have my little Slippery Fish parts with me. If you have yours, that's fantastic. But if you don't, that's okay, too. You can still sing along with us. All right. So I want to show you what we have. So this one is Slippery Fish. And then... Who's this? Hmm, that's an octopus. So we have an octopus. This little guy is going to be our tuna fish. Oh, I bet you all know what this is. It's a shark. This is going to be our great white shark. Look at those sharp pointy teeth. And then our last one right here. This is our whale. It's the humongous whale in our song. All right, so is everybody ready? I am, this is so fun. All right, are you ready? It goes like this. Slippery fish, slippery fish, sliding through the water. Slippery fish, slippery fish, gulp, gulp, gulp. Oh no. It's been eaten by an octopus, octopus, squiggling in the water. Octopus, octopus, gulp, gulp, gulp. Oh no, it's been eaten by a tuna fish, tuna fish. Flashing in the water. Tuna fish, tuna fish. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Oh no, it's been eaten by a great white shark, great white shark. Lurking in the water. Great white shark, great white shark. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Oh no, it's been eaten by a humongous whale, humongous whale, spouting in the water. Humongous whale, humongous whale, gulp, gulp, gulp. And that's the end of our Slippery Fish song. So that is a fun song to do. If you can do it with our little parts like this, that's fantastic. If you just want to sing the song, that's fantastic too. Maybe you could work on making some moves with your hands if you don't have the parts to do it with. That would be a lot of fun too. All right, boys and girls, we had a lot of fun today. We read Swimmy. You got to watch the Slippery Fish video, and then we sang, sang Slippery Fish together. We had a lot of fun. So, boys and girls, I will see you tomorrow where we will continue to explore creatures that live in the ocean. Bye for now, boys and girls.